all right i am back y'all um honestly i was waiting for my ring light to get here so that's why it took me so long to make another freaking video um i finally figured out what i want to do with my youtube you guys know i'm a beginner so um i'm trying to invest in my youtube channel and i'm starting to uh you know try to figure out what i want to do with it and what i don't want to do um I'm not a boring person, and I feel like some people's like YouTubes are like kind of boring. I like to talk. I'm a Gemini, so I feel like I should have a talk show. I feel like I should have a talk show for my YouTube. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. I made up my mind already, so that's gonna be it. Um, so I'm going to call it Playtime. Why? Because I consider myself a doll. Um, what do dolls live in? The palace. And I've been calling like my apartment the palace. Me and my friends, like we just came to the conclusion. Like I always be like, oh, we the dolls and stuff like that. So playing around like that. So I feel like that's cute. Like what do you do with dolls? You play with them. So I'm going to call my talk show Playtime. Because I'm the doll. I live in the palace. And we're going to have some playtime. So it's just me talking about different topics and... um sharing how I feel and my opinion on things and just talking what I do best but um don't look at my wig but look at my wig um this is love me here <laughs> I'm telling you she does it <laughs> but um yeah look at it mm. and that's it a little face you know um I'm not always gonna have face on for my channel but it's nice to have it on for the first couple of videos, but when I get comfortable, I'm not going to do this all the time. I already don't put a full face on. I do a cute eyeshadow, a cute a lash, a low highlight, bloop, and a cute uh, lip gloss foundation. That's it. So, um, yeah, let's get started. Um, but the first one I want to talk about is um, like shows on Netflix. I've been watching um, Money Heist. I feel like it's a good, it's a really good show. Um, I was like stuck on it, like stuck for a couple days watching it. Um, it's really good. It's about this uh, professor and he basically um, brought all these people together that um, can like have an aspect in robbing a bank basically so um they rob the the royal mint i think that's that's what it's called um it's basically where they print money in madrid i think they're in madrid um so they're printing the money or whatever inside but they're it's a whole heist so they're um shut they shut the whole uh inside down and they robbed it um but they didn't really rob it they're just printing money in there but they want it to look like they're robbing the place but they print their own unmarked bills. So it's really good. You should go watch it. Um, another thing I want to talk about is this virus. Um, it's some pros and cons. <laughs> um, I'm happy. Uh, I'm going to say the good first for me. Um, I'm happy that I'm working from home. Like I, I'm happy that I still have a job. Let me just say it like that. Ooh, something in my hair. Yeah, I'm happy I still have a job. I'm happy I'm still working. I'm happy um, about that. I'm saving a lot of money not having to travel to Hoboken and home. So that that's making me excited, you know. But the down and the cons are that um, I'm not able to see my kids like that I work that I, I work with and that's really like been eating me up. Cause I miss them, my, my four year olds, and some three year olds. Um, um, yeah, so I'm saving money. That's a good thing. A bad thing would be I'm missing the kids. Um, cause I miss eating. I miss the food. Like, I was able to just go to Chick Fil A. I was able to just go to a cute uh, uh Red Lobster, Hula Hands. I was able to just go and relax and enjoy eating out. But now it's like we can't really enjoy going out to eat. Like, are you kidding me? Uh, I can't deal with it. And then I need my space. Like, I feel like going outside and going to work every day 
was like making me not think about stuff and on top of that like I need to be out outside I need to be active like I need to be able to just go get a little bite to eat and sit outside I've just been in the house like I haven't been anywhere I haven't been doing anything so that's eating me up um this stimulus check child let's get into it but not get into it for real um I got my little couple dollars <laughs> it's gone mind your business um i went and paid rent i went and um got me a couple things that was necessary you know um or unnecessary but that's that's my business and that's not yours but um yes i'm enjoying it i enjoyed it it was it's going now like i said um so yeah i hope everybody else got theirs and they actually enjoy spending a couple of dollars i know i do i like shopping i like doing stuff i don't like that all the packages are taking two three weeks that's that's the part that's really pissing me off like why am i ordering stuff and it's taking about two three weeks off amazon or off ebay or wherever i'm ordering stuff off like my ring light i ordered this three weeks ago three weeks and yesterday it was supposed to come and they delayed it, and then it just came today. So I'm very excited. I'm very happy about that. Um, so, yeah. Uh, the thing I want to talk about is Kanye West. He's a billionaire. Um, yes, he's a billionaire, guys. I'm, I always say, like, Gemini's, I really, I'm like an advocate, okay? If nobody else said it, I'm going to say it. Uh, Gemini's are like so smart. He's a Gemini. And um, I just feel like we're so creative. And everybody be talking about that man. Like y'all better leave that man alone. He's a billionaire. Y'all ain't billionaires. So y'all ought to be praising us. I'm not a billionaire either. But I feel like whatever a Gemini does, I do. Like we're in like the same boat. He's a billionaire. I'm a billionaire. What you talking about? You can't tell me I ain't got no, no billions of dollars right now. I do. Mind your business. Um, so I just want to do a little, you know, a little shout out. I love me some Kanye West. I love through the fire, you know, all the little, all the little songs from back in the day. And now I do. I love me a good uh, Kanye West. Uh, something else I wanted to talk about was the DJs. They've been giving me life, like on this virtual stuff. Like they've been virtually like playing online and stuff like that on um the social medias and it's been like giving me life like it makes me feel like i'm actually at the club again like i i put my little clothes on i put me a little outfit on give me a little drink put a little hookah up and i literally be sitting in here dancing and singing as if i'm at the clothes um of course little man i, I listen to little man every night like he's the one that that that's really 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 been giving me life i want to talk about rod wave i love me some rod wave I don't know what it is. I like the way he say mama. <laughs> yes, I love the way he say mama. Like, yes, like I just love his accent. Like he has one of the cutest accents to me like in the freaking world. So yes, I love be surprised with you. I just wanted to put that out there. Like he make me feel like I'm a gangbanger. Like I listened to that uh, song. What is it called? Um, Rags to Riches. And I be just throwing up gang signs and stuff. And it just make me feel like, ooh, I'm somebody. So, yeah, I'm, that's why I like me some little Roddy Wayne. That was a little wink, y'all. <laughs> okay, uh, moving on. Tiger King. They need to free that man. They need to free that man right now. I'm really upset about this. Um, this is something I hold dear to my heart. Y'all need to go ahead and free Joe. They set that man up. They set him up. I, I, I have intuitions. Just like every other person. But I feel like I know what I'm talking about. From the jump, from jump, I was like, that man ain't do nothing. He did a little something. He killed the little animals. I feel like he killed the animals. But he did not, um, get that woman, um, try to go get that woman killed he did not pay that man to kill that woman he that man didn't even like him so even if he did pay the woman the man didn't like him from jump so why would he go kill somebody for somebody you don't like who who gonna be a hitman for somebody they don't even mess with 
that don't even is it, it don't make sense to me so with that being said they need to go ahead and free that man um i'll be a kardashian i'll be a little kim kardashian for joe um if he's looking for an attorney uh, let him know and I'll definitely be that for him because I'm going to work diligently and effortless, effortless, effortless. <laughs> Can I get my words right? Um, I'm going to work diligently and effortlessly. Well, no, I want to put effort into it, so I can't say effortlessly, right? Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I want to work diligently. To get that man out of that cell. Because he did not do it. He did not do it. Who's going to pay somebody they don't even mess with like that to go kill somebody? It, it's not adding up. I don't believe it. And um, they need to go ahead and free him before I do. I'm going to go rally up them tigers and get that man out of out of prison. Because he ain't do it. Um, but that show, like, I literally died from beginning to end like I was rolling on the floor cracking up like literally cracking the freak up um it's just too much but I don't think he did it Carol Baskin that lady she ought to be in in uh under the cell right now she need to be locked up uh Jeff need to be locked up uh all them they need to lock all of them up. That man said, I got a list of 30 names. He was trying to put 30 people under that cell with him. He's not playing no games with y'all. Y'all better free that man. And when he do get out at, at the age of 80 or whatever, he gonna be like 79, almost 80 years old. That man is gonna kill everybody. I said it. Don't call me when he do it. Cause I said it. It's stamped. He gonna kill all of y'all. And I'm gonna be right behind him. Well, I d don't really, don't really. Uh, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to take this out. <laughs> Cause I don't want y'all looking for me. That girl on YouTube said, "Nope, don't put me in that." Mm -mm. I said what I said though. Y'all better free that man before I do. And that's it. Thank y'all for. <laughs> oh, something else I want to talk about. Let me just throw it in here. Um, the TikToks. Can y'all stop? Baby girl, give me something, oh. Cause I won't stop loving you, yeah, yeah. Y'all gotta stop. Y'all is pissing me off. Every time my little FaceTime, my little nieces, they talking about some, baby girl, give me something, oh. I'm a savage, yeah. Yeah. Y'all ought to stop. I'm not a savage. I don't want to be a savage. Not during this quarantine. I want to be a worker. I want to go back to work. Why y'all want to be savages? Hmm? Mm. I'm calling your mother. I'm going to call your mom. I see one more video of a TikTok. I'm calling your moms. Be a savage with your mother. Y'all going to be savages together. Because I'm really over it. Stop making little TikToks. It's fun. It's cute. It's ha 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 ha. But if you can't dance and if you don't know how to how to you know get jiggy with it, stop. I can't dance, so y'all would never see me on no TikTok. Never. Never. I can't dance, but shit, I can't even do that. Baby girl, give me something. Oh. I could do a little robot. I got a little robot stamp. That's my dance. If y'all see somebody doing a robot, tell them to call me. It wasn't Michael. It wasn't, uh, nobody else started that. I started the robot. I feel like I invented that dance. And I'm going to copyright it. So stop playing with me. But anyways, I'm going to end this video. All right, so, uh, yeah. Thank y'all for watching. Go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Kia Imani. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned. And see what else I'm going to be posting. Uh, just, be, just check for me. Check your email. Bye.